Hey everyone, in today's video I'll be showing you a roundup of everything that I made during the month of October. I did finish my Halloween series last week so hopefully you guys checked out those videos but today is Halloween so happy Halloween to everyone and before we get into this I wanted to mention that I actually have an Instagram page where I post all of my crochet pictures so if you're interested in checking that out my name on there is Hooked by Jacqueline. If you do message me on this page I will most likely get back to you really late because I try to spend less time on social- well I'm trying to spend less time on social media so i'm on this page for like once a week and i'm on there for less than an hour i usually log on on a thursday because that's the day that i do volunteer at the crochet circle so if you do follow any of my tutorials and you decide to post them please tag me because i would love to see everything that you guys have made Oh, and I'm also thinking about doing a Christmas series, but I'm not sure if I have time for that because I have a lot of gifts that I need to catch up on. But let me get back to this Halloween stuff. So one of my favorite things that I made during Halloween are these candy corn mummies. Now this pattern took a while for me to figure out, but I love the end result of this. And candy corn is definitely not my favorite candy, but these are so adorable. My next favorite thing I made are these sugar skulls. Now this sugar skull took forever to figure out. I really wanted this to be a 2D instead of a 3D pattern. Pattern. but you know what at the end I do love how this looks and I definitely will probably make this again but I wanted to figure out how I can do embroidery on it that's the only issue that I had I wanted to do embroidery so bad but it just did not look right every time I tried the next item I have are my pumpkin treat bags. I only made one of this and it actually turned it into an amigurumi. I just put stuffing in it and gave it to the hospice because I'm not giving out candy this year. And then I have my mini ghost here. I don't have all of them to take a picture of it because I already donated it to the hospice. But that one's so cute. It reminds me of the Snapchat ghost. And then the spiders are the only things I couldn't give to the hospice because the legs are the pipe cleaners. If you did watch that video, I used pipe cleaners and then I wrapped it with yarn. So that's the only thing that I couldn't give. But... I think these are so cute and they definitely are kind of scary if you put them on the ground and it's dark time. And then um, the next thing I do have are my Frankenstein treat bags. I wanted to um, give this to someone this year, but I was like, you know what? I should just save this and then um, I'll do it extra special next year. So those are my Frankenstein bags. All right, don't laugh at this guy, but he's actually the reason I started my Halloween series because it was around September when I started to watch Halloween Town. And I was like, you know what? I'm feeling in the spirit. So I was like, let me just make this pumpkin. And I added like legs and arms to him. I thought he was so funny. I did make the stem portion too big, but this was a practice piece. I didn't make a tutorial on this, but this guy was the reason for my series. Now this one here, he's actually a pumpkin I made a long time ago with the yarn that the hospice has. And I felt like it was way too light. So I just saved him for Halloween time and then I added some scars and I thought it would be perfect for Halloween and then these last items I didn't make a tutorial on but these are still Halloween themed so I wanted to show you guys and this is just a pumpkin octopus and then I have another mini pumpkin here this one's so soft and cute I love this one and then the last one I have to show you is just another octopus using velvet yarn it's actually two more so this guy is velvet and then the next guy I'm showing you is velvet but that's basically the end of my little haul series so happy halloween everyone and i'll see you in my next video